Hi, welcome to Learning Monkey. I am Vikram. In this class, we'll try to implement. We'll try to implement the complete company database. So far, in our previous classes, we have covered uh, this uh, the conversion of requirements to this uh, ER diagram. And after that, the, we have converted this ER diagram into database schema. Now, in this class, we will start implementing this complete. company database these are all the tables and the relationship relationships among the tables and uh, the clear description about these uh, database this database schema has already been discussed in our previous videos if you haven't watched those videos please watch those videos and come back here and every video in our channel is going to be a part of entire course or a playlist our suggestion is to follow the entire course so that you can have better understanding of the concepts and the link for the playlist is provided in the description below now coming to this class now this uh, database uh, database schema we will try to implement this database schema into this uh, database so this uh, this is our entire database and these are the values that we are trying to insert that we will try to insert in this class in this class we will try to insert these values uh, into this tables into this tables and uh, uh, we will try to insert all these values and it is very important to use only these values because in the next coming classes we will try to uh, we will try to understand uh, different types of queries uh, different types of queries on this database how to retrieve the data uh, uh, different types of queries we are going to understand for that understanding we we will try to have it is better to have these values as it is so please try to insert these values as it is uh, 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 as given in this diagram and uh, uh, let's start our uh, uh, sql and uh, try to create our own uh, we'll try to create uh, our database okay so uh, here what we have done is we have created listed all these queries all these queries are listed one by one so just you have to create you have to create uh, one after the another so after that after this these queries are for creating the tables and these queries are uh, uh, for inserting the values into the database all the values are inserted see it is more than 4 to 5 pages all the values are inserted uh, all the values are given here in if you if you execute these queries line after line one after the other the entire database will get created so that we have seen in this diagram so this entire database will get created so we are not going to do all these lines of code uh, first we will try to insert we will try to create the databases and after that we will try to insert some data and from there it is very much easy for you to understand so start with our first query first query we are going to create our employee database and in this employee database we we haven't created the foreign key so as we have discussed that d number is a foreign key and it is referencing a d number of the department what we will do is we are not going to create the foreign key for this later later because uh, if we create this it is going to create some ambiguity while inserting the data so what we will do is we will uh, we will alter this table so we will first create this table and later we will alter this table here we are using a, a command called alter alter table so using this alteration uh, using this we, we will try to alter the uh, table employee so employee table can be altered and we are going to add a foreign key so we are going to add constraint and that constraint is foreign key constraint so what we will do is we will just copy paste and we will do the things as it is in the, uh, in the sequence later in our later classes we will try to see how we are going to alter the tables so later we will try to solve lots of queries and we will try to understand the complete sql part in detail in those classes we will try to uh, see the command called alter table so let's just uh, start our uh, first query which is create table okay table created it's very simple but our suggestion is uh, please try to type the content on your own that helps you a lot that uh, that gives you a lot of practice you'll get lot of errors and you'll get used it to with uh, use it with this tool and if you are familiar with this tool and if you feel that they are not required then you can just copy paste okay so the second department table has been created and after that department locations 
okay created and next is a uh, project table and this pdf is provided in the description if you want to uh, get this pdf uh, click the link provided in the description there you can get all the content okay uh, project table has been created and next is uh, works on table see here while copying uh, be careful okay works on table has been created next is uh, uh, dependent table this is our last table to create okay and while designing also this is a good practice first uh, writing them on the page and uh, then implementing it okay so now uh, we are done with all the all kind of uh, creation tables all the tables has been created now we will uh, try to insert the data into the tables the first row into the employee table okay created so in this way so all you need to know is just try to uh, execute each and every line so we are not going to show you everything and uh, so uh, here we are going to stop our uh, video or uh, we'll go until this so until this alter we will try to do that okay so next is uh, this insertion second row third row fourth row okay uh, that's more than sufficient i think uh, so uh, you already know how to insert or uh, we have already discussed in our previous video so by this way we, you can insert all the rows and uh, continuously uh, uh, line by line uh, command by command uh, try to copy it and paste it on your uh, sql so you will get created with uh, the complete uh, database picture so the complete database will get created so this is all about how to implement the complete uh, uh, company database hope you got the clarity on this concept thanks for watching if you haven't subscribed to our channel please subscribe to our channel and press bell icon for the latest updates and if you have any doubts regarding this concept please post your doubt in the comment section below and if you feel that this video is helpful to you please give us a like symbol and please share this video with your friends so that they will also get benefited thanks for watching